Yep. Hi, everybody. It's April 26, 2020. I'm Laura. I'm Brenda. Welcome and we're here. Back. We're yeah. here for another cross tube remotely uh, from each other. I know. How are you? I'm, I'm good. I'm good. good. I just want this to move on. Yeah, really. Move along. And we got another order of another 30 days till the end of May like mm -hmm. this. So, yeah. Oh. Okay. But thank goodness for stitching. Oh, thank my goodness. goodness. Can you imagine without, mm -hmm. I would go insane. And now it's more important than ever that we have stash. Ooh. I mean, we have stash and we can live off our stash. That. Yes. For as yes. long as necessary. Yes, exact amundo. So yeah. anyhow, so what's new? Uh, well, what have you been working on? Well, I've been working on two things. Okay. I think after I finished the the damn grass sampler, I which I sent to Terry at Total Framing, and we picked out the most awesome frame. I can't wait till it comes back. So. Anyways, anyone, um, I had, we had a couple comments about how do you send your stuff to Terry? I just iron everything. I roll it up and then I fold it and send it off FedEx. She gets it. They stretch it so well. You can't see yeah. a wrinkle, nothing. So there's no reason to have to worry about sending in it a tube or any of that rigmarole. So um, just let her know ahead of time. If you're interested in using her, let her know ahead of time that it's coming so she can be on the lookout for it and she can let you know when it arrives. So anyhow, question. So I finished that, but yes. Uh, is that going to be hanging in the living room then? Well, that's a good question. <laughs> <laughs> Because the last I looked, my living room didn't have space. So there will be some rearranging going on. But oh, we'll see. We'll see. So I'll get them back both at the same time. The Blackbird, All Joys for Thine, oh. and Sarah. They will ship together. Because it will save on shipping charges. So anyhow. Okay. So what have I been working on? I've been working on this. <laughs> this is right up my alley right now. After that Sarah finish, this is so funky. The colors and the, let's see if I can do my best Nicole. But aren't those colors beautiful? I mean, Very. And it, this is the country sampler conversion. If you want to use these colors, you need to contact them. Um, it's their conversion. I can't give it out. So, and here's my start. It doesn't look like much, but, and it's not. Oh, but look at that turkey. It's all purple paint. Really? With red, with red um, dots on it. I mean, this girl, Jane, Jane Baxter is her name. She had, the colors she uses are just so cool. And I think that's why I like it. And yeah. it's easy. This is 36 count weeks parchment, the old weeks, which um, it's not too bad. And I got, I was going to do like Carol and do the border, but I got bored. So <laughs> I came over here, but I just love these colors. And here again, because people ask, it's Jane Baxter, 1838 by Victorian Rose Needle Arts. So I'm really enjoying that. Oh, I love that one. It makes my heart race. Oh, well, you need to pull it out. You have yeah, it. Yeah, I have pull it. Pull it out. Mm -hmm. And then I decided, because I got some stash, which I'll show you later, but then I did make a small start because I wanted something little, easy finish. This oh. is by Stacy Nash, the red hydrangea pin disc. And these are the colors. And I got this kitted from Country Sampler because Carol did. <laughs> Carol Saltbox Stitcher, bad influence on us. So. <laughs> and here's my start from Friday night. Oh, I'm ordering this. Yeah. I can't yes, take it. One. I can't. And, there, and the chart, Laura, is so big and clear. Really? I, yeah. And this is 36 count. Uh, Winter Brew by r &R. Oh, I love Winter Brew. I know. And by r, &R. So, yeah. 
tomorrow. Yep. And I put it in a project bag. This. Oh, that's I have beautiful. Nice. Mm. So that's what Wait. I've been working on. What about you? Well, let's see. I haven't done anything that I was supposed to be doing because I figured I could do whatever I want during this time, whatever makes me happy, which I knew you yes. go for that. Yes. Um, yes. I think I showed this last week, didn't I? Miss mm -hmm. Lila's house. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yeah. So I actually worked on this last Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, and maybe part of Thursday. Yeah. Wow. Wow. Good. Oh, wow, you got a lot done. Yeah, it, I did. It's very pretty, very, very pretty. Are you, what are you, what are you doing that on? Mm, 40 count Lakeside Vintage Pearl Barley. Okay, it's very nice, with the DMCs, right? Yes, DMC, good old DMC. Yes. Yeah. So I really love this. Um, Good. I do. I do. But then, pretty. of course, I couldn't pretty. make it a whole week with stitching on the same thing. Okay. So actually, okay. oh yeah, I worked on that Thursday too. Friday night, I started something. This is by GGR. Yeah. I and love that. It's called Mademoiselle. We got that. Yeah. yeah. Mademoiselle Viola Martini, 1876. I love that. So pretty. And it complies with the red law. It does. Even though it has other stuff in there, That's it's right. mostly red. So what I did was, I didn't want to just go bing, rare, rare. I went like this. I started, and I started each row so I could get oh. down to this. Oh, good. And let me yeah. just remind you again, I just started this Friday night. Oh my gosh, Laura. I know. Wow. So I'm working on that big wreath in the middle. And then when I'm, when I'm tired or tired or at night. What have you done with Laura Duet? She's gone. <laughs> um, and I go back really and just do stuff. Yeah. And, um, and this is on a scrap piece of 40 count lakeside vintage maritime white. Wow. I love it. And I love the idea that you did. So that yeah. you get down to the good stuff. And then you can go back and do the rows as necessary. Right. Very good. Very good. Right. Um, one of the reasons I got so much done on this is because we're binge watching Damages on Hulu, which was on regular TV before. But um, I know Brenda's frozen right now. But now she's unfrozen. Okay, good. Um, so oh, there we're, we watch, we're binge watching. And so, oh, I love binge watching. And I never saw that show. I have to just, tell you about a binge watch that I did on Floss Tube when you get done. So. Oh, okay. Uh, Damages with Glenn Close. Really oh, okay. good. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. We watched like nine hours yesterday. Oh, my gosh. Great stitching time. Then. Mm -hmm. That's why I got so much done. What binging on Floss Tube are you speaking of? I did. Um, I had not watched Barbara's Daughter before. You had mentioned that last time. Mm -hmm. <sighs> wow. Wow, she's really good. I really liked her carefree attitude about yeah. uh, adjusting colors and her projects were great. It was really fun to watch her. So yeah. I watched Floss too while they got caught up on a lot. Um, who was the other one? Uh, how do you say her name? The Stitching in Idaho. Uh, oh yeah, I've awesome. watched her new one. She's yeah. gonna have 31 stars for Mania. Yeah, it's really good. Really, really good. Mm -hmm. I'll be watching that. It was just, yeah. Good. But Barbara's daughter gave me some courage, and I'll, I'll show you this morning about ch changing your floss colors and everything. Oh, good. Um, because she was. Oh, oh, oh. Technical difficulty. Stand by, stand by. We're going to keep going. We're going to keep going, yeah. So. Uh, Brenda's frozen, but we're going to keep going. Are we still recording? Yeah, we're still recording. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> I'm just like, let's keep it going. Because, you know, last time we stopped and then it was like the whole day was like trying to get this done. And right. I got I got a binge watch stuff today. Anyway, yes. so yeah, um, you got to watch lots of floss tube. That's good. Yes. 
Yes, it was very good. Very, very good. What yeah. was Rick doing while you were watching all the plus two? Um, he was in the garage. Oh, he's okay. cleaning his garage and he's making a couple things for our daughter. So oh, for, okay. for Megan. Yeah. Yeah. And he's in the garage today because I told him <laughs> no, inter- no TV and no internet until we get this done. Yeah. Although it's proving that that's not the problem. I don't know what the problem is. I wonder if Zoom, if you paid the money to Zoom every month. I, I think it has to do with the connect, our Wi-Fi connections. So who knows? Anyways. Um, okay. So something else exciting that happened this week was yeah. um, Amanda May at Art of Designs. She wanted to comply with the law, so she designed this darling red sampler. I know. And she said we inspired her. It's very nice. Very, very nice. And this is perfect for anyone wanting okay. to start out, do a red sampler. There's no over one. You can pick any red color, cotton, over dyed, silk, no. whatever. It doesn't matter. It's very darling. And yeah. you could finish it in a frame or a little pillow or whatever you want to do. Yeah, and she, she said that she purposefully designed the size so it would fit in a standard frame. Oh, that's wonderful. Mm-hmm. That's wonderful. Yeah. yeah. So count the cups. Yes. And, and our name's mentioned in the write-up. Woo-woo. I didn't even say that. I looked at the chart and the cover, but I didn't even read that. Oh, my gosh. Yeah. Oh, wow. Isn't that's that so sweet? nice. She's really. I watched nice. her video on Friday. Yeah. That was fun. She's very, very, very positive, and I like that. Very Easy nice. To to, and a positive takes you away from all the crap yeah. that's happening in the world. So. Yeah. Yeah. She's very, very nice. Very talented and very sweet. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Thank you, Amanda May. Yes. And her um, channel is Ardith Designs on Floss 2. So, right? Yeah, I think so. Yeah. A-R-D-I-T-H, Ardith Designs. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Okay. Very good. Yeah. Did so, you get any stash this week? Um, no. I did. Oh, good. Yes. I, I did. Stash. I got um, I got something like, and my husband gets the mail now. Rick gets the mail. So, he sees everything coming in. But... Oh, well, I got, well, first of all, I showed you the one Stacy Nash, and then I got these other two from Country. Kitted? Yes. And here's, I mean, look at that. And these are very easy stitches. There's not that much to them. About that. Then I got this twice. I know, cuckoo. Cuckoo. <laughs> I got, I ordered it kitted from, okay, enough box. <laughs> I ordered this kitted from Country Sampler mm-hmm. because, and then I forgot that I ordered it from Ann. So I got a package from her yesterday and there was the chart again. So I really like it. You can have one of them. So. Oh, thanks. Anyways, yeah, it's really pretty. I really, really like this one. So yeah, you really, really do. And I must. And you know, I'll, a true confession here. This is the third charts this market that I have bought two of. I know. All right. So next then I got spreadsheet. I know. I need. That's the. I work with spreadsheets all day. I'm not about to work with them at night. So all right. I oh, got you this. got that. And I think just I like the sentiment. Forget about the fact that we're in yes. what we're in. But stay yeah. at home and stitch applies to me anytime. Other yeah. than seeing my friends going to retreats and going to my local store. Yeah. This would be my motto anytime. I love it. And it comes on a really nice card. And I think that Brenda is donating some of the um, sales to yeah. um, something to do with the pandemic. I'm not sure if it's nurses, doctors. I, ca- I can't remember. So yeah. Sorry. And then I told you I got a package from Ann, so I got this. This is the newest club kit from Quaint Ladies. I think that's darling. It is. Very. Very cute. And all the stuff in it. And just a little side tip. I don't know if you do this, Laura, but they give you the color thing here. I cut it out right away and put it in the package so I know exactly what the colors are. And it's all right here, ready to go. 
Yeah. Everyone needs to do that. <laughs> if you're in the club. <laughs> then I got that. Oh, oh. Isn't that pretty? Pet all the dogs. Yeah, I or love you could that. change it to pet all the cats. Yeah. They've got a conversion in here, different um, graph. So anyways, that big red house looks beautiful. I Try like the angel it. above it. Yeah. And the the red and I just think it's um, it's really pretty. I think she came out with some beautiful charts this market. Extremely. Well, I'm not done yet. <laughs> because then I signed up for Nancy. And this is Victorian Model Threads. Um, you can find her blog on, just Google Victoria Model Threads. You can send her an email. She does all these thread collections and she does fabric too. So I signed up for a fabric of the month and oh, this is it. That looks beautiful. It is, it is, Laura. It's I'm sending really an email beautiful. right after this. Yes, this is called, she doesn't really name them, this one is called Vintage Sampler. It's just, and it's Zweigart. And it's very reasonably priced and good for your stash. Love. Great for your stash. Yeah. And then one more. I know you wouldn't tell that things are going haywire. <laughs> I downloaded this. This is the, a bargain. It is 41 pages of beautiful charts. There's a reason why there's, there's really four charts in here. One, two in color, two in black and white. The uh, one of them is just the reproduction without her extra words down here um, that says, stitched when the world stood still in 2020. She does it in color and black and white. So it's really a great bargain. So I need to, decide what I, how I'm going to stitch it, whether I'm going to use silk or DMC or whatever, but great deal. PDF, instant download. Perfect. Okay. That's it for stimulating the economy. <laughs> for, the, for last week. Yeah. And I don't have really anything else. And yeah. some of this was a while ago that I had ordered. It wasn't any fine. But yeah. Yeah. We have to keep the money moving around and keep That's these right. stuff in business, even if it's only one little chart that yeah. helps them out. That's yeah. right. Yeah. So that's right. Mm -hmm. So uh, I know you're wearing your Michigan shirt. Yes. And I'm wearing my rolling bay hay and feed, bay hay and feed. And I had to show this because that's a, a store that's on Bainbridge Island and I love it. It's cool. a, it's like this store that has hay and feed and plants and cute gifts and we oh. have to go there. Like a old fashioned general store mm -hmm. type. Thing. Yeah. Okay, cool. Yeah, cool. All right. So uh, everybody's talking about Stitch Mania. And so I said to Brenda, Are you doing it? Knowing full well that no, I don't think she is. But I said, What if, what if we were doing Mania and we were doing 10 projects? What would we pick from our stash? Mm -hmm. So uh, we went and we each picked, I stuck to 10. I don't know if you did. I pretty much did. Okay. I can, I know which ones I'm going to choose. So, okay. All right. So let's go like you go, then I go. And okay. Okay. Go. Okay. Number one. Oh, and before I show this one, uh, Olivia B has a new video, which I love her. Video. I did. Oh, that's the other one I watched. Oh my God. Inspiring. Very. Uh, her first very, one, even is Ann Ufendel, and it's, oh my goodness gracious. And it's her first reproduction sample. Wow, way to go. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. She was very, very inspiring. Yeah. I loved watching it. Mm -hmm. She showed a lot of Stacey Nash stuff. So, in yes. honor of Olivia B., um, my first pick is Rosebud Cottage. Oh. Mm -hmm. Rosebud Cottage Pin Keep by Stacey Nash. That's a oh. great one. Yeah. Now, well, if you were doing Mania, this would be a perfect one. Yes, it would. It would be. It would be. I love that. Yeah. I don't, um, 
Do, can you match a Stacy Nash? Oh, you've got I was just seeing that if I did pick a Stacy Nash, and no, I had some this morning, and then I put them back. So. Okay, this will be interesting though. So you go with your next one, and I'll see if I have one by that designer, and then blah blah. Uh, okay. Because okay. I'm weird. No, I don't have a Stacy Nash. All right, that's fine. What do you have? But I, when I was going through my stuff, I found this one. Um, and that's a good one. Are you gonna do it on murky? Yeah. Yeah. This is the. I gotta take that off. Flag oh. folk by Not Forgotten Farm. Yes, flag folk, and this is the country sampler conversion on Murky. Why I haven't started this because so it could go on my wall right there. Oh, I, don't know. I love it, and I love Murky, and I think, I think, think, think this is thirty-two, so it would be easy to do. Yeah. Do you use two strands or one? No, their 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 conversion says one strand Good. over two threads, so it's going to look different, um, yeah. you know, coverage cool. wise. Yeah, but yeah, I think it's cool. So that's Totes my cool. first one. Well, I don't have a not forgotten firm, but there okay. are several on my radar from not forgotten firm. One is a witch who's riding a whale. <laughs> huh. Anyway. <laughs> Uh, the next one is one that our friend Pam finished, Quaker Work Tray by Chessie and Me. That's beautiful. I know. Beautiful. I know. Yeah. So That's that another good one. Yep. I don't have any Chessie and Me All either. right. Well, all right. Oh, yes, I do. Oh. Woo, woo. This is really not a new start, but one that I should get my button gear. Oh, please do. So. Mm-hmm. But I pulled that out when I was, love it. Carol's yes. um, finished that. Carol Saltbox Stitcher has finished it, except for the over one. I don't know how she's doing on that. So That's um, Esther Edison, I-D-D-I-S-O-N, I believe. Yeah. And here are the colors. I did change the red because I'm not a fan of Buckeye Scarlet. What'd and not just because to? of the Buckeye the <laughs> Oh, but no Ohio State references shall be made. Oh, lock of mercy. But I changed it to Schoolhouse Red oh, because okay. Sampler Farm changed hers to Schoolhouse Red. So well, I have to Carol that. did it then. Then it's okay. Mm -hmm. But I didn't get, I haven't gotten very far. But this is one that you could pull out. You know how some people are doing some whips as part of their mania? This would fit right in there. That would be fun doing a whip mania. Yeah. But I'm, I, my head's not in the right place right now. I'm just too yeah. crazed. Yes. Sometime we'll have to have, when we have all our time and we're back together again, we could do a whip parade and have like a three or four hour video. I think it would be more like 24 <laughs> hours, really. <laughs> okay. What you got? I have Plum Street Samplers French Woolens. Oh, I have yeah. Every time I see this model at, at Dying to Stitch, I just love mm -hmm. it. Yeah, I do too. And actually, I have all the threads for it too. I, did you start it or just? No, I it? haven't started oh, okay. it. Okay. Sometimes when I get on a, a sampler kick, then it's hard for me to switch to a non-sampler, but I've got to get mm -hmm. over that. I'm sure Total Framing did this framing and it's amazing. Yeah, I love that frame color, that yeah. frame choice, yeah yeah so very nice i don't have oh, a plum guess stitch. who stitched the uh model our deborah i love oh. deborah hi deborah yeah yeah very good very good okay got any plum street no no plum okay. street let's see what's next um let's do i like this it's on a Brenda kit today. That's beautiful. And I started it, but I have to tweak the colors a little bit. And I think after watching Barb or Kim yesterday, um, that's okay. I can change the colors, you know? Oh my. Um, Life I don't like this color right here, avocado. I think it's too yellow. Mm -hmm. So I've got to change something. I like the other colors, but yeah. that one. So, anyways, and I wouldn't finish it in the box. 
I would have um, do the drum. Drum. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna do the drum. So. Anyhow, that's my next one. What about you? Okay, I don't. I don't have any with thy needle and thread in my pile yet. Okay, at this time, but I do have this by Pineberry Lane, wow. Winifred Clark, and I have it. I have the thread, so I could start it anytime I want. Mm -hmm. I love that. What fabric do you have? Well, I don't have. I mean, I've got my stash that I would pick. From, oh, okay. okay. But I've got the threads, and I don't know why. Well, I guess I do know why, but um. There's a change in them. I, I think Anne and I at Dying to Stitch might have changed the colors. Oh, okay. Okay. I think Anne, did she finish that? Probably. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Very, very nice. I like that one a lot. Uh, yeah. I, it's a good, it's a perfect sampler in every way. Mm -hmm. And when people ask for the perfect sampler, Pineberry Lane has some really yeah. great beginning samplers that they could stitch mm -hmm. yeah many many i don't have any pineberry length okay but i do have this mm -hmm. I oh, yeah that. we need to talk about this yeah i um i would do it on i know you would like to do it on two pieces i said that but then i thought about it and I don't know how the hell I would do it. So I'm doing I don't need that one. That how to join this area here. So I would probably do it on one and I just whatever fabric I could get. It's either Heartland or Wren where they called for. So or something else. I mean that new, that new linen you got from Nancy Turner might be. Oh that's oh that's a great idea. Great idea. Mm -hmm. Very good. Thank you. Oh, it's my turn. I got yeah. another Stacy Nash. Oh, good. I know you have this in your stash too. Yeah. Fresh picked pin keep. I love this. It's charted with DMC and I have the DMC. I mean, how much fun would this be to stitch? Yeah. Yeah. And I don't even think that basket's filled in. I think it's, it's not. just, yeah. Yeah. I mean, it's that's very fun, fun, mm -hmm. fun, fun. Very nice, very nice choice. You pick some good ones. I like Why, them. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Okay. Then I picked, I picked some in, two insane ones. So oh, I'll do, good. I'll do a crazy one right now. Good. Because I saw someone. Oh. This. Yeah. I mean, why have I not started this? Oh, I don't ever. know. Those are the colors. I know. I love it. I love it. Why haven't we? I, we've seen so many people doing this, and someone was almost done with it yesterday. I mean, I almost had a hernia and a heart attack when I first saw this thing. And and you were all gung ho on it. You got the thread drops. You put your thread on all yeah. that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, maybe May first. Well, there you go. And that's that's next Friday. Friday. Yeah. Let's Things talk about on that. Friday. Maybe yeah. we should start it then. It's very pretty. What's it done on? Straw. Uh, straw. Okay. Oh, that got my heart racing. I know. That, that's, an, uh, that's a crazy piece because you couldn't finish it. But. Well, who cares? Yeah. <laughs> Just the fun, right? Yeah. And look, it, I guess the grass, too. Go ahead. Sorry. Oh, grass, yeah. Hog. Wild Windmill by Lottie Da. I mean, That's so you. I know. I so love it you. so much. Yeah. Why well, I haven't started I it? Don't even, I, don't know. I don't even know if I've really seen that before. That looks like an older one, is it not? I don't think it is. Oh, okay. That's a newer, newer-ish one. Oh, okay. I think, yeah. Okay. That's perfectly you. Yeah. Love yeah. it. Very nice. Okay. Um, then I've got... Again, I guess this is kind of crazy. I don't know. But all of these, <laughs> this count is one. Um, I've done a couple of them. But these were came out so many years ago. And I think Brenda said to do them like early morning stitches or something because they're so easy and they're finished so fast. Um, 
I should just get a ring. You know how we have a ring oh, of man. Blackbird? I could go through here because her color palette is so similar. Mm -hmm. And at least put them on a ring, all the colors. And I have the Abyssidarian that they're done on. I got I love that from them, so, um, mm. But I'm missing March. I have to track down March. I don't know what happened to it. I think I, I'm not sure. So, anyhow. Okay. What else you got? I have by hands on design stitch one over two. I don't have that. I need that. Yeah. I, I like that. that. Yeah. Do you, I are you, would you do the two separate fabrics there? Well, I would like to because it looks so cool. Mm -hmm. but I have to figure that out. Mm hmm. Which I don't think it's pretty hard to figure out. But no. Yeah. And no. it comes with this little wool piece in the. Oh, yeah. I like that. I think like Pat, that. our friend Pat, is working on this or finished it or something. Oh, okay. Okay. Probably. Yeah. And I bet, Laura, you could do the two pieces and just send them off to Belinda and she would work about, worry about yeah, figuring well, it out. She would have to because <laughs> <laughs> I could not. It's not in our realm. No. Okay. Okay, and I got two. I don't know how many we're on, so keep track. This oh, is another Francis. one. Mm -hmm. Francis Gatsby. Graspy. <laughs> yeah. Gatsby. Francis Gatsby. Francis. Again, with oh, all my the early days. I know. Look at that beautifulness. And the um, Helen. Ellen Chester Needlework Ellen on Instagram is almost done with this. It's beautiful. I think it's much prettier in person for than this chart shows. Mm -hmm. I love it. Love it. Love the colors. Love it. Anyhow. Okay. What else? Do you have? I have another, I have something by Kathy Barrick. Ruth Ellen Haystack. Am I frozen to you? I might be frozen. I think we're going to freeze, but we're going to keep going. Yeah. 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 Keep going. Okay. Am I back? Go. Oh, yeah. Yep, you're back. Okay. Oh, I love that. I know. Yes. I got this when we went to uh, Stitchville last year. Oh, okay. I like that a lot. Classic. I think it's one of our older pattern patterns. It's just oh, classic. It's that old. Oh, okay. I keep saying that. I don't think it's that old. No, it's not that old. <laughs> Anything within the last two years, right? Right. Okay. I um, I want to start this like now. So this could be a mania start mm -hmm. in this, this. And this calls for some DMC, which I was not able to track down. So I had to... Um, change some things up but i even kitted it this morning oh my i know what fun i changed some thread color a couple thread colors because i didn't have the dmc and um carolina stitcher's doing it and she changed her red to chili pepper well i didn't go quite that far but i'm going to use a victorian motto wow. and i don't have the thread or the fabric but Carol suggested vintage light exemplar, and this is the perfect size for it. Oh, that's great. That I already had. That's going to yeah. be fun. I want to stitch that too. It nice. Would be, oh, that looks beautiful. Like that. So, and I put all my DMCs on rings this morning, and I even put on the little. Um, oh, I love that thing. one. I think this is from sampling of memories. I'm it sure. is. I know it is. Yeah. It is. Yeah. So, that's perfect. Anyhow, I love this one. I love it. And I'm not sure about the box. I don't know. I haven't decided about that. I love this way it's displayed here, but we'll see. We'll see. Choices, choices. So, are you there? Yeah, I'm here. I'm okay. still here. Okay. okay. Next up. Yeah, the work press. You could go around the corner and show your finish of this. George and Hannah Ashmore. 
You see um, me? Yeah, I can see you now. Okay. Oh, yeah. I just said you could run around the corner and show your finish. Yeah, this. I could. Why don't you? Okay. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'll be right back, please. Okay. Hold, please. Brenda's going to show us her finish of this because it's really, really, really cool and it's framed beautifully. It's all oh. about framing. Oh, my gosh. Ah, look at that. Oh, this is the frame. Oh. It's just an itty bitty piece. Um, our friend Karen and I did it at the same time, and it's on 46 count with the um, Bell Yeah, you need this is a really again a small project, and you can do it on any size, it's easy, easy yeah. peasy, no over one. So, and total framing. I mean, look at that frame, that is a thing of beauty. I love that frame. Magnificent job. Yep. Buy them. That's yep. what makes it worthwhile. Mm hmm Okay. I only have one more. So did we get 10? Are you yeah, because I only have one more too. Oh, perfect. And then this one. Oh yeah. You're a grand old flag. Yep. And country sampler conversion. I know. I love that. I know. Oh. <laughs> I think that, uh, yeah. What the heck's the matter with me? Oh, well. Hey, I to I'm in the same camp. I totally agree. Just looking at that makes me happy. Yes. Yes. Okay. Um, the last one I picked for today is by Gloria from Milady's Needle. It's called oh. Jenny Brimmer or Brimer. Oh. I don't know if I remember seeing that. I think you have. I think we got uh -huh. it at summer school. Oh, okay. You might okay. have. Look at this part. Yeah. The sheep. I love this. Th that really very want, cool. Yeah. I yeah. really want to start this soon. I love that. Yeah. Very pretty. Very, very pretty. And Gloria does beautiful, beautiful charts. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Her instructions are mm -hmm. top notch. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Very nice. Yeah. Very good. I even took them all out of the packaging. Now I got to go put them all back. Wow. I'm impressed. Dedicated to my craft. Yes. Yes. <laughs> all right. Uh, so what are you going to work okay. on today? Well, I'm going to work on Jane and then I'm going to try to finish one of those little Stacy pin discs this week. So we'll okay. see. I mean, it should be easy. You know, it's nice, easy stitch after work and all that kind of stuff. So okay. Jane today. Okay. Anyhow, but how about you? What are you going to work on? Um, I'll probably work on uh, Mademoiselle for a little bit more. And then who knows? I might root around and see what else I can play around with for the rest of the I, I love that mademoiselle. That's really pretty. Mm -hmm. Really, really pretty. It really so, is. Yeah. Yeah. Are you using the cottons? I forgot to ask you. Did you say yes, the called for. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. okay. okay. Yeah, it calls for cotton over dyed cottons. Very good. Okay. Okay. Well we made it through. We did. Okay. That's great. Yes. I will yes. um get it okay. out, out there to the John Q public whoever wants to see this. There you go. <laughs> and have a great week. And yeah. Have a great week, everybody. Get lots of stitching in. Stay yes. safe. Yeah. Thank all you again for all your comments. They mean the world to us. Yes. Yes. Yeah. A little bit of normalcy in our crazy world. So yes. it's good both ways. Yes. Okay. All right. Well, we'll be back next Sunday, possibly with a special guest. Yeah. We'll see if we can figure out the technical technology part of it so yeah, that be fun. it'll be fun yeah okay well okay. thanks for everything bye, bye. love bye. you bye yeah, love you guys bye